Welcome to Sports Evolution 360. I am a Jojo, and today I am joined by the one and only Acheva, the analyst. We're bored. The numbers guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so today we're going to be looking at uh, the match day 13 review of the PSL, and we're going to start off with the Blue Eye Chiefs versus the Green Fuel, and this happened at uh, Luveve st Stadium. So I think, uh, Cheva, you can take us through. Yeah, Blauai had a lot of games this weekend um, at Luveve. It was Green Fuel who needed uh, two first half goals to edge uh, Blauai Chiefs at Luveve Stadium. Mobile Sibanda scored the 20th minute and Bukosi extended the lead with five minutes before the break. That, uh, that win sees Green Fuel won 13 points with 13 games. And then um, Blauai Chiefs are winless in four games. Mm, this was a, a, a very good game, I would say. Uh, but let's just uh, move on to the Manika Diamonds versus Shesham that happened in, uh, at Gibo Stadium as well. Yeah, at Gibo Stadium, it was a game of few goals. Uh, Manika Diamonds just managed to win 1-0 there. Fortune Beans, he could have extended his, uh, his goal tally to 10 goals okay. if it was not for Zivanaichi Kweweri, mm -hmm. who had uh, two goals that he cleared off, off the line uh, from the same player. So this was also, I would, I would, I would say it's, it was a fair game, to be quite honest. As long as we have goals, it's, it's, it's a good game. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah. Uh, we move on to the FC Platinum and uh, versus, that, that was versus Chicken Inn at Mandawa Stadium. How, was, how did you see it? Uh, it, was, it was a game of two halves. Um, FC Platinum scored a goal in each half uh, to seal the victory. Mm -hmm. and then, um, but it was not without controversy. It was, okay. you know, chicken in in the 17th minute, uh, Malvin Water scored off a header by George Majiga. And then, uh, but the referee waved it offside and then mm -hmm. the goal was disallowed. And then 12 minutes after that, um, Benya in the 29th minute, uh, put Platinum up in the lead. And then poster boy, Autumn Sona, he delivered the final blow in the 17th minute. That win sees Platinum on 24 points. Uh, and they move on to third position. And then chicken in suffered their second defeat of the season. And then their winning streak has been halted in three games. I think we've been having so many issues with um, with the referees, especially this season in the PSL. Yeah, I think I think I think they need to go for a refresher course. <laughs> okay, we need to move on to the next one, which is Ngezi versus uh, Mwange at the Baobab Stadium, which saw Ngezi winning two one. The log leaders they keep marching on. They're not they're not being faced by by the pressure of being at the top of the pile. Definitely, definitely. Yeah, because um, two first goals. Two first half goals was all they needed to to finish the game off as a as an encounter, yes. and then captain captain Kudzai Chigunya, uh, he scored a header off a Najib Akumbi free kick uh -huh. uh, that was to give them the the lead, and then the Wangi goalkeeper had a momish of the week, who his his goal kick rebounded off a off Ngezi player, oh, yeah. and then and then a striker Tino Tenda, uh, he headed home for the for for the second goal. They did get a consolation, however, in the in the second half. But then that's all the game. Uh, that was all the, the goals of the game. The game ended 2-1. Mm, okay. Moving on to ZPC Kariba versus Yada at uh, Nyamunga Stadium, uh, which shows that PC winning 2-1. I think... Yeah, the, the draw kings, they drawn their last four. So this, this, this win will be a moral booster in the camp. Uh, they secured <laughs> a 2-1 two win, two win over the Miracle Boys, uh, Yada. That was at Nyamunga, is it? <laughs> yes, yeah. definitely at Nyamunga. So these were the games that were on the last. So we're going to move on to Sunday. Stay tuned.